after the Supreme Court asked the government to carry on with its efforts to retrieve the dead body from the coal mine at East Jentia Hills in Meghale. Indian Navy divers and the NDRF personnel have been on a war footing to pull out that dead body that was detected last week by its remotely operated vehicle. The Navy suspended its efforts to pull out the dead body last week since it was getting disintegrated when being pulled out by the ROV. Now, this was explained to the Apex Court and victims' family members were also present there. But while the family wants at least parts of the skeletal remains, the Supreme Court has asked them to continue efforts to pull the body out until the next hearing, which is on the 28th of January. Meanwhile, district officials have been trying to contact the five people who had escaped the mishap on the 13th of December for a better idea of the mine to enable faster detection and retrieval of the bodies. The remains of the body were pulled out near the main shaft, but the process to bring it to the top of the mine will take some more time because of obstructions. That's what the officials are saying at the moment. Now, NDRF personnel and Navy divers have yesterday started the operation once again to pull out the dead body, even if it gets disintegrated. Remember, uh, since last week, we have been reporting that uh, the remotely operated vehicle of uh, Indian Navy was able to detect one of the dead bodies. And then these pictures were also shown uh, to the family members. Uh, the Indian Navy divers and NDRS did try to pull out that body with the help of the ROV. Remember, uh, the divers cannot dive in and uh, go to the pit of uh, the rat hole because the water level uh, uh, in the uh, rat hole uh, in that mine uh, has not changed a bit even uh, after you know what has been pumped over three crore liters of water has been pumped already but the water level has remained the same as it was on the 13th of December when at least 15 miners got trapped after the mine got waterlogged and now they appear dead now what uh, officials are saying that the other uh, dead bodies uh, might be behind this dead body so it's important to get it out but it is completely disintegr uh, disintegrating given the fact that it's highly decomposed and that's what was told to family members as well as uh, the supreme court but the supreme court has asked the government to keep trying uh, until uh, the, the next hearing on 28th of january and that's why the government has now gone forward with a stepped up efforts to even try uh, to get out the body or whatever remains they can even if the body gets disintegrated because the family members have also made it clear that even if they get some part of the uh, skeletal remains they, they can do the funeral they can do the burial so uh, that's why these efforts have been taken but uh, yesterday they could not retrieve the body because the ROV got struck uh, in obstruction there are obstructions inside and today they would be trying once again so uh, all eyes would be on this operation uh, uh, in East Jantia Hills.